Hi, I'm Samuel McCullough, advisor to the Signals Project, and today I'm going to walk you through the alpha, which we have released just recently. So if you come to our website at signals.network, you'll be able to create your own account. So if you haven't already, make sure you come and sign up. Uh, you put your name and information and email address in here. Uh, we'll send you a link, and then once you click on the link, uh, you'll be taken and you will go to uh, the home. So when you first log in, uh, it's going to look like this. And you're going to see at the moment six strategies which uh, the Signals team as well as the CryptoFox uh, team, uh, one of our partners, have developed. Uh, and this is what the platform is going to look like, at least in its early version. So over here, you'll see that there's portfolio, visual editor, uh, the marketplace for strategies, indicator, and data, as well as the community section. So today we're going to focus on strategies uh, because that's what's been developed so far. So uh, individual developers will use the forthcoming visual editor uh, to either drag and drop strategies into place or to provide code uh, that will make the strategies work. Uh, once those strategies have been created, they're placed into the strategy marketplace uh, where you can come and you can see all the different ones. So right now we only have six, but we'll be opening this up soon to other developers and other traders who would like to put their strategies into the marketplace. So let's choose a uh, moving average strategy. So if we click on it, uh, we'll be taken into more detail of the trade. So here you'll be able to see a description of the actual strategy, uh, who the author is, uh, the amount of votes that it's gotten. Uh, and then on the right, you'll see a chart with a visualization of the buys and sells. And then also the strategy stats over the past six months. So this is a, a back testing um, that tells you, you know, all the things that you need to know when designing an algorithmic strategy, uh, namely your average profit, average loss, average trade, the win rate, uh, which in this case is 51%, which is good. It's not it's not losing money. <laughs> uh, and then your max drawdown. So, and then additionally, after that, uh, once you take a look at the stats, then we can look at the individual trades, uh, which the algorithm has given. So here you can see uh, whether it's a, uh, uh, a buy. So if it starts out at a buy, uh, we'll buy, what, what is this? Uh, Bitcoin. Yeah, so we would buy... Uh, Bitcoin at $1,019 and then we'd be selling at $1,019. So that would actually be a loss taking into account fees. And then you can go through and you can see the individual trades and how they stack up and uh, what they would look at look like being broadcasted on the network. Uh, so additionally, uh, you will also soon have an indicators marketplace. Uh, where you'll be able to tie in different indicators. So right now we're looking at just a moving average. Uh, later on, there'll be uh, more complex and more developed indicators such as sentiment or uh, different ones that uh, people can create and put into the market. So uh, let's say that you like to use uh, Bollinger Bands and uh, Keltner Channels to find squeezes. So you would be able to uh, code those indicators into the indicators marketplace, and then people would be able to buy them. Uh, additionally, the data that sources all of this, so the, the charts over here will also be a marketplace as well too for you to purchase that data uh, to have, you know, whether it's sentiment or price action or uh, any number of um, uh, events and data that you can plug in to make your uh, signals trading bot the best that it can be. So once you have all of those together and you have a strategy that you're ready to pick out, in the alpha, uh, we're not actually able to copy trade yet. And that's a forthcoming um, feature that will be rela released in later versions. What you can do now is uh, turn on a uh, Telegram notification. So if you click on on, uh, you'll get a notification saying install Telegram. And uh, it says add signals notification bot to your telegram so let's click the link and hit allow and then here we are and uh, i'm going to click start okay there we go so when we come back to the signals marketplace and we come back here and then we turn notifications on 
turn on notifications. Now everything is linked. So when we come back to Telegram here, you can see that it says notifications for moving average have been turned on. Uh, you can turn them off in the strategy detail. So for now, this is the extent of where the alpha is going. It, it kind of shows you the, the first steps that we're taking, uh, showing to the public of what the platform is going to be capable of. So at the moment, uh, you have uh, the detailed uh, strategies which will be broadcasted out to you uh, when they get activated. So if there was a moving average cross or whatever was created for your signals trading strategy that you pick, uh, whenever it fires off, you would either get a buy or a sell notification in your Telegram page. Uh, later on, you'll be copy trading. Uh, so you, that's what we have so far. There's a lot in the works, actually. Um, in the next few months, we'll be releasing a multitude of different ways to integrate with uh, the platform, provide different strategies, indicators, uh, create your own strategies. And we're extremely excited about what's coming up. So we look forward to hearing from you about your experience using the alpha version of Signals. And make sure to follow us on Telegram and on Twitter. And uh, I hope you're all looking forward to the upcoming ICO because we're very excited about what's, what's upcoming and what we're going to release here in the next few months. Thank you and have a good day.